Again, it's Priscilla Batzell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expression St Studio Gallery in the backyard and I need you to keep your fingers crossed that my camera does not overheat. I have a silicone ice cube tray from Tuesday morning, which is a store sort of like TJ Maxx or Marshalls or any of those places. I, I haven't seen them anywhere else, but then I haven't looked. Um, I had four different colors in there. This is my OXO omelet turning spatula I'm going to use in a second. I'm going to make sure there's no nubbies on there. This is a 16 by 24 inch canvas and I am going to unplug my white paint bottle in a moment. Oh yes, same thing, different day. Get rid of anything that came in on the wind. Give myself a nice layer of white paint. I was going to add black and blue and gold, but I forgot. So, it is what it is. It's a hot day. Best to move quickly. I think maybe because I'm in the mood to experiment and we don't know what we're going to do because I have chain and I have uh, medical tubing to blow air into things and I'm going to ribbon pour all of that paint right out. I think what I want to do is add that black around the edge and I actually pick black. Sometimes I pick Prussian blue. I really want to use my other Omelet turning spatula available on the Amazon link. Best paint spreading tools ever. So that I can keep some of that paint from getting mixed up. And go all the way to the edge. Use my spatula to tap it on. I'm going to squeeze it right in. It is an awesome tool. I, more and more people are telling me what an awesome tool. I like I told you so when it comes to awesome tools. I like awesome tools. You can trust me on that. I love tools. My grandfather owned a lumber company in upstate New York. That was a long time ago though. Before I was born. I never got to meet the man. In any case, so we have some paint colors flowing over the edge and usually I would tell you that I would like to keep my edges clean because I'll be tipping but you know it's the last painting I'm going to do today because it's been hot and it's time to go in. It's getting close to supper time. Um, what are my other excuses? I don't know. I don't need any. I just want to wipe off all of the paint and put that in the bucket and the same for this one and put that in the bucket. Now whatever I'm going to do boy is going to be that and I'm going to take my Princeton Art Tool Catalyst Spatulas and I'm going to excavate as much of that paint as I can knowing what I know which is a lot of times I can do all kinds of cool stuff even in the face of adversity <laughs> and uh, I'm not saying I will but I'm not saying I won't Got some amazing cells up there. I don't use any silicone in my artwork. In my paints, I should say. I'm a little distracted, sorry. Because I don't like cleaning it off with things. I don't have any mud because I'm taking that straight out. I may pull out my chain. There's a couple things I've always wanted to do. Like just put skewers into things and pull them. But, um... I don't know why I'm not willing to take the ultimate chances, but eventually I work my way around to them. All right, so I've got most of the paint out of there, and that's good because I hate wasting paint. <laughs> and as she excavates yet one last scoopful. All right, so that was going to be not good very shortly because it had been sitting here for hours. And I'm thinking that this is cool, and we should just go ahead and find an edge catcher Nice fresh edge catcher. Kind of wish I had a. Uh... Oh, right over there. Let's let it all cool. I haven't done any accidental, seriously accidental art for a while. I'm going to throw that right back under the canvas and let it travel the other direction. We got serious rainbow is isms going on here. I didn't put any gold in there and I kind of might like to. I'd like most of that paint to move in a different direction, but I kind of like the colors that are down there. 
So maybe I'll go this way and see what we can get for cells popping and waves of paint moving. Very abstract. Let's see what we got and what we might want to do. Alright, so if I were going to use a skewer, I would just stick it in and pull it sideways. My paint's a little thick today from having sat outside so long. But anytime you agitate paint with Floetrol and Deco pouring medium like I have, you're going to get some kind of reaction in the way of cells. I have no idea what I'm going to get and I'm inclined to do whatever I feel like doing at the time, which could include, you know, pouring copious amounts of black or white up through the center or even gold. I like that. I wish I could keep more of that. Looks like I had a little canvas showing. I've got Princeton Art Tool Catalyst Spatulas, which actually swipe very nicely. That was something that did not belong. Goodbye thing. And it is just time. It's just play time for me. I think that's what's going to happen. I'm just going to play and make marks because mark making is what I like to do anyway. It's what abstract art expressionists do all the time. They do a lot of mark making. It occurs to me I probably could have made a nice forest, nice tree trunks out of those rainbow colors. This may be a two-parter, as in I might decide that uh, whatever I have today is going to become something different tomorrow. Secret video. What else do I want to do to that? I see that I have a space that the canvas has started to dry up. I'm going to try and get the paint off my spatula, which is looking rather difficult. I haven't got any brown yet. I'm pretty happy about that. I can always use my Princeton Art Tool Catalyst Spatulas to just wind my way up and back and through things and make marks. I haven't added any chain. I really love chain. It's always hard to restrain myself from using some chain. But um, I want to keep wiping off the spatula. Actually, I'm going to rinse it off. Maybe I'm going to even find a new, cleaner one. I do keep two of the square fronts for just such an inevitable... I love that purple showing up like that. That purple is just stellar. Makes me want some more. Assuming I can get anything to come out. Let's see. And I've got some of this which is the iridescent pink. Oh, must be full time. The edges are not covered yet, but they're quickly becoming covered. I need to, um, what do I need to do? I need to check it out and see if I want some black in there. And maybe, since I have some, some chain handy, just have some fun. No plan. Except for to keep a rag handy, because I think you cannot use the chain without wiping it off. I love that color. How do I get that color back? Where is that color? Is that a color that made itself up? Or is it that color right there? I think it's that color right there. And all I need to do is get the thing that's restraining it out of the tip. Yeah. All right, well, you know what I said about the chain. I'm just gonna let some, 
some paint flow down over the side. Use my chain to make some awesome shapes. And use the paint that's already on it to accent the paint that's coming on it as I move it around. I think unless I use a fresh piece of chain, I'm not going to be able to continue keeping the mud from occurring. But I got some neat marks. And like I said, it could still be a tomorrow thing. I'm just going to clean that off. I have a tremendous amount of flaking paint on my fingers, too. Well, what I see there is that I want some more white. And um, because there's no bats, all bats are off. Let's go ahead and loop that chain up. See what happens. What are you thing? I want to use my shirt as a rag. Probably not my my wisest idea right now. I could just drop that. Can I? Can I just drop that in there? Some of the paint that I used is a little on the gloppy side, and I want to take that right off of there and let it relax somewhere else. I really want some more white. I really want a clean piece of chain too, and I actually have a bunch. Just depends on how clean clean has to be. I have some amazing patterns here. I haven't used the torch today because as I use the acetate cards, which you guys did not see, I'm gonna let that white get wiped off. Um, I think I flatten out all my bubbles. What's over here? I don't see anything I want to save in that gap. And I see I have another gap right there. And there is quite a bit of paint on this canvas right now. There's no doubt my edges will be covered. I don't want to take that black line away. I really don't. And if the paint weren't quite as thick as it is, I would probably have much less trouble keeping the black. I haven't done a straight up fun chain thing in a while. Alright, so I think that that is pretty wild and I'm going to take a torch to it. Although, sometimes when I do this, come back later and I want stuff that I don't have. That rag is now in my way officially. And that stuff could be this. Or that right there. Or that right there. Put those right there, which I do really love putting spirals in. Not so sure about all that brownie stuff. I'm going to have some stuff to clean up, I can tell you now. Very tempted to see what happens. Yes, I like that. Wow, we got some really amazing stuff happening, actually. Because the brown is not brown at all. It's more like rainbow. Oh yeah. We are having fun now. It's 
Sorry I'm quiet. It has to happen sometimes. Uh, I want some of this blue right here. And I want to take the torch to things, but I don't want to um, I don't want to set the paint up anymore right now. Oh, I love that blue. Wow. Of course I always did. But it adds a lot, in my opinion. There's some green. I got a minute left. <laughs> of course I do. I think I'm going to have two minutes to tell you guys to shop my Amazon link if you want to help me out at no added cost to you. And you will find the OXO omelet turning spatula there. Um, this could be a garden. Sure. Why not? using chain and cards. Why not? Alright, so if you shop my Amazon link, you'll find the book called Because I Can, I wrote. And if you purchase the um, soft soft cover version, you can have the, uh, the ebook for another $2.99. My editor wants me to tell you, so I told you. I'm a good girl, for the most part. <laughs> and if you want to shop any of my other stuff, and that would be of assistance. I have Curios. I have I have Curios. I have Fire Note America and Pixels.com, which are pretty much one and the same. I have Teespring underneath the video. I'm just having a ball pulling stuff with this card. It's wonderful, therapeutic fun. I recommend it. It's a whole new way of doing a flower garden or whatever this is. And I should show you what I can see up front. But every time I swipe in this nice thick paint, it, uh, it agitates the paint and adds some more cells popping. Oh, please come out. Thank you. Probably not exactly the way I wanted it to. Get the paint out of there. You're going to be gone in a minute. So this is Priscilla Batzell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Start Studio Gallery in the backyard saying, if you want to join this month's contest, contribute to the studio and look for the video in the last 20 seconds on the end screen. Now I don't know what that looks like. Oh, it looks perfect. It's exactly what I wanted. This is very cool. <laughs> I'm really happy. I got some beautiful, some beautiful leopard cells. I got some great chain marks. I got some freaky colors. I love you guys. Keep making comments. Thank you for all the contributions that have kept me painting in the past. I have no idea when you're going to be gone, but I will turn it around. Oh look, a big blank spot. I think that deserves some gold. Now I need to know if that goes. Yeah, that goes fine. <laughs> Alright you guys, I'll see you again. Check out any of my other videos. There's 520 of them on the playlist, at least. And uh, give me a thumbs up if you would. I'd love that. Thank you very much for coming. I'll see you guys again. If you're still here, I'll be torching for a minute. And if I want to do something to, to this tomorrow, I will. It's just a very intense... It's a new kind of garden for me. a few more of those as will happen I'm gonna have to touch up my edges for a while take one more gander at that I think I want some more of that green I do, I do. Paint will heal paint. Even when I dig right down to canvas. Wipe off my rag and I'll see you guys soon.